cross, so so why do I? I, 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 did, I got to this point and I stopped. <laughs> yeah, this is where you're supposed to give up. <laughs> no, it is, it is, it is. Because I'm is. like, no. No, no. Okay, just grab something yeah, else. Yeah, the, the Y side was fine. The other side. Yeah. That's actually a U sub. Yeah, it's actually a U sub. It's a really tricky U sub, though. Ah, U okay, so squared of X. U, okay. U squared. And then U squared is X. Is X. U squared. Oh, okay. Beautiful. Why, why do you do that? Well, watch this. Because it gets rid of the radical. It ah, gets rid of the radical, okay. and then you get 2U DU. Okay, so yeah. Okay. okay. Magic. Magic. And then this becomes... Well, dx is 2U DU, and then we have E to the U. So dx is 2U DU, so you get 2U E to the U DU. Yes. 2U... Mm -hmm. And then y dy is the other side. And y dy is the So you're just subbing those in. Yep. And... D. Okay. What technique do you think we should use now? It's like, what's the fastest way to do it? Just the letter T. Is it tabular? Tabular. <laughs> tabular. Yeah, tabular. Yeah, I know. Just the letter T. So, so, so okay. two, two U to zero, right? You just write down the part that is eventually going to be zero after repeated differentiation. So two U to zero. So this is plus, minus, plus. And then you keep okay. integrating, right? So, so it would be e to the u, e to the u, e to the u. That was easy. Yeah, I know, right? Yeah, that's, that's a nice one. Yeah, yeah, e to the u, e to the u. Integrate a thousand. What's the thousandth integral of? <laughs> <laughs> I win. I win. Oh. All right, so this is y squared over two. What is the infinite? Oh. Mm. And this this bad boy here, we're going to tab tabular. So two u e to the u. So two u e to the u. Minus. Minus. Yeah, minus. 2e e to the u. Alright, 2e e to the u. Yeah, yeah, I see that. And then, oh, then plus uh, c tilde. Or you can just call it c if you want. Because. Mm -hmm. And I, like uh, I guess we should solve for y, so multiply by 2. Uh, so we right. y squared equals 4. And u is the square root of x. Let's go ahead and replace all of the u's with square root of x. Mm -hmm. Sorry. Uh, so this is the square root of x, e to the square root of x, minus 2e to the square root of x. Plus four, four, four. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Mm -hmm. Five through by the four C yeah. tilde. Plus, no, 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 two. two. C tilde. Because mm -hmm. yeah. okay. <laughs> Sorry guys. <laughs> <laughs> oh, 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 uh, let me take okay. the square root. The square root. Yeah. He's so good he doesn't know it's under under the, on the camera. <laughs> yeah. So why is equal to mess up now? So why is equal to uh, plus or minus? What's that symbol called? No square root. That's a square root. So <laughs> That's a what? Or x e to the square root x minus oh, four e to the square root x. Plus oh my god! What a wreck. Two 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 mm -hmm. All right, and we're gonna. Well, I have to say this is fantastic. <laughs> Well, it's fantastic. Yes, absolutely. Yeah, this is get new. some. <laughs> all right. Um, so now we're almost there. What's what's left to do? What we have to find. We have to we find to the, the condition. Explicit solution. Mm -hmm. Oh yeah, we got to plug in. Yeah, we got to find mm -hmm. C. Yeah. Impose the initial condition, Impose. right? So yeah, I know. I love that word. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Where else do you get to use it in life, right? Impose the initial condition. Yeah, impose the IC. Uh, impose the IC. So six. Uh, Sound of mathematics. So it's a six. That's that's the Y. Yep. <laughs> Sorry. There we go. And this is plus or minus the square root of. Now now when you plug in one here, this is just going to be four e. Yeah. And this is also four e because square root of one is one. Yeah. So four e minus four e is zero. Zero. So this is gone. So you get two c to the bit. But which one is it? Is it the plus or is it the minus? It's the plus. Yeah, it's the plus. plus. Yeah, because yeah, six can't be, square root can't be negative, right? No. So six is not negative, so it's six equals square root two c to the And how do you get rid of the square root? What do you do to both sides? Square both square sides. Them. Square it, yeah, no, good, good. And so you get 36 equals two c to the divided by two, so c to the is 18. And you know, we could have called it c here before doing all this. I just never do because I'm you want to write Don't it trust it. Because it's a yeah. waste. Yeah. It's, it's an extra step. Yeah. I got you. I got you. Alright, and then so it's y equals. It's the plus. Yeah. And then it's 4 square root of x e to the square root of x minus 4 e square root x. And then it's 2 c to the less. So 2 times 18, so 36. 36. And I think what the homework does is they factor out a 4. Right. You can just they leave did. It. Yeah. I'll just leave it. Yeah, it doesn't matter. And that's it. And that's your answer. That's the answer. That's my answer. Huh. I am. <laughs>